Libra. Welcome to your reading. I got messages for you. So before we get into this reading, Libra, um, I'm picking up. You may have to defend yourself against someone that is strapped for cash. Okay. You may have to stand your ground against this energy. Uh, this may be like a pest. This may be somebody here that's coming to like, um, uh, basically like get on your nerves. This person could be like side eyeing you or looking at you funny. This could be an ace of cups. Okay. Or somebody here has some secret feelings for you. We got the moon, the ace of cups here. Um, I feel like somebody needs some money from you, but I feel like with this energy, they don't know how to spend their money or like, it's like somebody wants to take from you and they want to like hide money or they want to like keep some money here or this could be what somebody is keeping from you. This could be the father of your kids that's hiding money from you or keeping money from you. This may be, this could be anybody here. Okay. So we're just going to hop in and see what's going on. Protect me as I channel the messages for Libra. Any and all negative energy being thrown my way, I ask that you return it to sender to them and their loved ones instantly. So it may be. So let's see. What is the messages here for Libra? Sun, moon, rising, all placements here for Libra. What is the messages here? Spirit guides, angels, and ancestors. I hope y'all having a wonderful day. We got the Empress coming out, period. That came out in Aries reading, lavish, abundance, giving birth to your dreams or new ideas. Some of you guys could be pregnant, okay? You don't have to be, but this could be like how you're seeing like across the world as the Empress here. I feel like you could be getting supported or you could be receiving a loan or maybe you paying off some type of debts or you could just be being supported here, okay? Or somebody's giving you gifts behind the scenes, Empress, okay? Let's see. You could be um, nurturing yourself and nurturing others here, Empress, okay? Ace of Air with some type of new idea. I feel like you could be having a breakthrough right now at this time. I feel like you could be seeing the truth about a situation or this is some type of brilliant idea that you have, Libra, okay? Um, maybe this beginning could have been a little bit challenging for you, but I feel like you persevered through this. I feel like you have mental clarity here as well. I feel like you see things for what it is, and that's just what that is. Yeah, and I feel like you're standing your ground and doing so with the Seven of Wands. I feel like you're standing your ground because I feel like somebody's trying to make you have some type of loss here. So right now, I feel like you could be making long-term plans here. All right, so like I said, you could be making long-term plans, okay? Uh, new ideas, inspirations. I feel like you're seeing the truth regarding the situation here. We have the three of earth, which is the three of pentacles, the power of creativity, recognition for very high quality work, be a team player. I feel like you could be collaborating with people or you could see the truth about um, this collaboration here. You could be moving on from some type of collaboration here or you're learning some, something new, okay? You got justice. Fair and just decisions. Do what you know is right. Stand up for your beliefs. Yeah. Something that had to do with a betrayal. The end of a difficult situation. Embrace the change and expect things to get better now. Recovering from an addiction. So some of y'all could be recovering from something or you could just be getting over something here. Just take your time. Yeah. Six of fire. I feel like good news is on its way. You could be getting victory here. Especially when it has to do with like earthly matters, which you could be working on here. This could be like um, your bloodline. You could be getting victory, especially when it comes to like breaking some type of generational um, curse, generational cycle here. Something that's repetitive that keeps going um, over and over and over again. I feel like the release is here. This is the end of a phase, a situation, a spiritual transformation. Time to move on. Yeah, the nine of earth. Enjoying the life's little luxury, spending time, quiet time along, success, successful self-employment. Yeah, you work for yourself. And you could be very empathetic, patient, and loving. We have Archangel Azrael release. Yeah, this is the end of a phase for you, Libra. Okay. I feel like, yeah, I don't know what this King of Pentacles want with you. I feel like somebody sees you as the Empress and maybe they want to come and like use you or I don't know, man. They're coming in with an offer though. Give me this Empress though. Let's tap in. Yeah, here we go. We got the King of Pentacles. Taurus energy. Okay, or this could be a masculine that's coming towards you with some good news. 
page of wands somebody here is like communicating with you or maybe they have some type of new idea or they want to implement a new idea with you but i feel like they want you to pay for this there's something here when it has like to do with like an idea this person it's like it's a good idea of course this could be good news but they may need you to front them the money for this idea king of pentacles page of wands yeah, the lovers. Uh, well, I'm hearing genius. Okay, Gemini energy. Somebody is saying that they want to make love to you, Empress. Or that they are in love with you. Or they have a deep soul bond with you. Okay. This could be a Gemini. I feel like this energy is looking for you. They're like, where did you go? Give me the lovers. This could be a soulmate or a twin flame union or a deep bond. Y'all just share. It's like two kindred souls. I feel like um, y'all feel like y'all supposed to be together here with this lover's card. We have the two of cups. Yeah, the ace of wands. So yeah, this soulmate twin flame ordeal. Two of cups, the ten, um, the ace of wands. I feel like um, somebody is going to be communicating about how they want to start a new passion and beginning with you, or they want they want to. Somebody want to have sex, Libra. I mean, <laughs> somebody's looking at you highly attractive here. I feel like somebody's looking at you like you're the empress. So it's like they could be, this energy could be at work, just like thinking about you or contemplating about you or masturbating to you, Libra. Okay. What else can I say, Libra? I mean, you sexy, Libra. Damn. There. You sexy, Libra. Okay. You're very attractive. You're very sexy here. And I'm getting this energy is addicted to you. It's like, it just is what it is. You're sexy, okay? You have sex appeal. I mean, you just, yeah. So I feel like there's a new passion to begin. Or somebody wants to start something new with their soulmate, twin, or, or whatever this is. It could be a Taurus. It could be a Virgo or a Capricorn. What's this ace of air? But I feel like you got the truth about somebody here already. The truth is, somebody here is like selfish or... <laughs> Or they want you, somebody here is selfish when it comes to you. We have the high priestess. Could be a Pisces. The truth is, you're somebody's wish fulfillment, Libra. The Nine of Cups. Mm, the Queen of Wands in reverse. I feel like you know the truth about this person. The truth is they would rather deal with like their wish fulfillment is prostitutes and whores. Their wish fulfillment is like even though this person like sees you as a boss, they sees you as the empress. They see you as somebody here that they can do business with. They're in love with you. But it's like this person like has been like, you know the truth that this person has been like with this queen of wands in reverse. This could be a fire sign, um, a Leo um a aries or a sagittarius okay somebody here could have been sleeping with somebody here that's very jealous okay or somebody here could have did a love spell or this whore could have did a love spell and i feel like you see the truth that this energy likes dealing with karmic energies this is why like you feel like you can't fuck with this person you're more on a you're more on a like high vibrational type of love and this energy yeah, Libra, I feel like you see this energy, like you just know the truth that this energy rather would rather settle with karmic energies or they would rather like their wish fulfillment is like being around, being around like jealous individuals or queen of rhymes and reverse people to hear that they keep their legs open for everybody. Somebody just like people that that's a pass around. OK, even though this energy is like I'm guessing they're in love with you or they want to partner with you or they feel like you're the one for them because you're their empress. But at the same time this energy they want you to make peace with working with them and they have a hoe that they working with too i don't know this is like kind of like weird okay but this person by this person working with this karmic energy this karmic energy slows them down the knight of pentacles what's the queen of wands in reverse this energy is jealous conniving they're a bully um and it's like this energy sits up and laughs okay about being a bully or about you know what i mean being jealous and bitter or this person could do divination as well queen of wands in reverse somebody's jealous as fuck yeah the queen of swords maybe you spoke about this you said that this queen of wands was jealous or they were bitter or they were trying to bully you or when it comes to the intellect intellect this person can't even match you yeah so somebody's like they like to lay on their back 
And I feel like you spoke this. You you, you told this person they like prostitutes and they like hoes. They leave you the fuck alone. Queen of Swords. And I feel like this King of Swords lied about it. Yeah. This person feels like they know it all too. They, it's like they could be saying like, oh, that person's not a hoe. They're not this. They're not that. You know, I guess the, you, yes, all you did with is hoes, nigga. Shut your lying ass up. I know the truth. You like hoes and you like prostitutes. Until then, like, listen, if that's what you like, then that's what you like. But don't come to me. Leave me the fuck alone. Queen of Swords, King of Swords. This person's a liar. Yeah, the Nine of Cubs. They pretend like they go and follow their heart, but really they're drunk or this like this energy is just like not reliable or not trustworthy at all this person is led by their addictions they get drunk and they like to sleep around with hoes and prostitutes and then they want to come in and attack you because you know the truth or you telling the truth about this person or you're just very direct and honest give me this king of swords in reverse like the secret is that they're a liar and it's not really a secret is it or the secret is they try to attack you this, that's the secret. They try to attack you behind the scenes with them and, they, and this hoe, this queen of wands in reverse. It's like this energy comes off as the king of pentacles to you, but when they're around their karmic energies, it's like they're a karmic too. But when around you, like they want to be divine and they want to be like, oh, like, yeah, man, I'm the one for you. Somebody's a shapeshifter. They fake as hell. You never know what you're going to get from this individual. You're not going to get the truth. I tell you that much. I don't give a damn how much you try to get it out of them. Like, so was you fucking with that hoe or what? Or was you fucking with that, that queen of wands in reverse? That, the one that's a pass around that's for everybody or what? And I'm getting this king of swords. It's like, nah, I, I never fuck with that person. But they're a liar, though. This is what they like. And I'm getting they, they both attacked you behind the scenes. Not only did this person lie about fucking with this Queen of Wands in reverse, they both attacked you behind the scenes. And this person's still trying to come in your face on some fake shit like, like y'all cool and like they really fuck with you like that. Give me this um, Three of Earth. Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, I feel like you're going to get a new opportunity here. Give me this Queen of Wands in reverse. I feel like this Queen of Wands is a liar and this King of Swords in reverse is a liar. This person's coming up as a as a karmic soulmate. Yep, this temperance. It's a Sagittarius. Yeah, it's a Sagittarius here that this person could have been sleep, sleeping with. Or the Sagittarius is a hoe. They possibly went towards this masculine with an offer and they lied about it. Yeah, they took a leap of faith. And I'm getting this this masculine is keeping a secret. They're going to carry this secret to the day they die. They're not going to ever tell you that they slept with this queen of wands. So I'm getting this queen of wands could have been like a friend of yours. Okay. Or this could have been, this could have been somebody here that was, um. Yeah, this could have been like a friend of yours that this person lied about. They say they didn't sleep with them. They did. This Queen of Wands, their legs is open to everybody, man. I feel like you and this King of Swords could have been married. Okay? You could have been married to this King of Swords. Or if you wasn't married, then I don't know. But but there's this is the secret here that they're not going to tell you. Cancer, Pisces, energy, the moon here is cancer. This could be a cancer, Gemini type of ordeal. Or somebody has cancer and Gemini in their chart. What's the moon? Yeah, I feel like you know the secrets already. Look, the high priestess. You are very intuitive. <laughs> you know this person's deepest, darkest secrets. You know what they're hiding. They can't hide nothing from you. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles here, please. Four of Pentacles. I feel like this opportunity that's coming towards you, keep it to yourself, okay? Don't share. Don't tell nobody when this opportunity is coming here. Hold on to this opportunity. Don't even share it here, okay? Keep this close to your chest. Somebody thinks that they can control your opportunities. They, if they think that they control what comes to you. I feel like that's, this is in God's hands. Yeah, we have the devil. Somebody's obsessed with controlling some type of opportunity, and we got the Queen of Swords in reverse. Whoever this line, I'm so sick of this lying ass Queen of Swords that's be coming out in these readings. 
I'm so sick of this lying ass hoe. What's the four of pentacles and the ace of pentacles? If somebody's lying saying, oh, I got, I got control over their, their opportunities or whatever opportunity, it comes through me first or I get the last say so or something. That's because they're doing divination. I feel like this energy is just not respected with the hierophant right here. This energy is not respected or they're going through some type of delays or standstill. So, <sighs> what's the four of pentacles, ace of pentacles? Ace of cups the moon something here when it comes to your new love um this is going to be a secret i'm seeing new opportunities here that you may have to keep to yourself i feel like this is a part of your justice libra i feel like you want to get a new opportunity in love it could be from a cancer or a pisces that could be coming to you okay but maybe you don't see this new love being handed to you. Maybe you don't see this. Like, this is like a gift coming to you. I feel like you need to keep this close to your chest because there's some type of new opportunity here. And I feel like there's people here working together to see when, like, you're going to get this new opportunity. You got three aces out here. The ace of, ace of swords, the ace of pentacles, and the ace of cups. Oh, no, all four aces. Wow, Libra. You have the ace of wands, the ace of cups, the ace of pentacles, and the ace of swords. So, I feel like that at the end of the day that's what she wrote you're gonna get what you want the ace of wands the ace of cups the ace of pentacles and the ace of swords i mean oh yeah you finna be set i feel like you're gonna have everything that you want you're gonna have the love you're gonna have the money you're gonna have the sex okay you're gonna be the, your person gonna be truthful and honest you know what i mean you ain't gotta deal with no lying ass nigga or bitch whatever you ain't gotta deal with no lying ass because i feel like you've been through a lot especially when it comes to love if if she if you got a venus and aries like me man y'all know y'all been through some shit in love okay and i've been through some shit i done made the wrong decisions in love and sometimes i still do okay but i own up to my i own up to my mistakes okay i own up to my mistakes and i own up to that hard-headed ass airy side of me but um you know the libra with the libra my libra rising is what keeps me balanced and my virgo moon keeps me mellow you know what i mean but if i just had straight aries in my chart baby i'd be a fucking firecracker but yeah i just feel like uh you're getting justice justice for you is the ace of swords it, new beginnings in all areas I feel like, yeah, a new beginning in love, a new beginning when it comes to your money, your finances, a new beginning when it comes to, like, truth, ideas, or having a breakthrough intellect. It's like you're going to be thinking differently. You're not even going to be thinking the same. A new beginning when Ace of Wands, new passionate beginning, new ideas, new talents. Like, you're discovering, like, new ways to, like, um, generate income. That's what I'm getting. I feel like maybe this King of Pentacles, this possibly wasn't a real King of Pentacles. Yeah, this is what your your fate, your fortune is this new beginning, the fool. It's like somebody tried to go and, and do divination or dark magic here on your destiny. Give me this justice card. What is Libra getting justice for? Okay, we got the Queen of Wands. We got the fool here, but give me this justice. Somebody made a bad decision. Give me justice here. Yeah, five of swords. Yeah, against some discrimination here. Yeah, we have the tower. That's too many cards, though. I'm not taking all of them. This could be discrimination amongst a group of people here that try to discriminate against you, Libra. Yeah, that's what I'm seeing. This could have been like hate, um, competition, envy, or just, you know, I feel like you're getting justice in that. What's this five of swords? Yeah, with this group of people here that try to just get, yeah, these people celebrate here when it comes to your work. I feel like you could be skilled. You could be a master at what you do. You just focused on, or, or you're determined on your, you're very determined when it comes to your goals. At the end of the day, it's like you, you started with Libra and you end with Libra. It's like you started with the, with justice and you're going to end with justice, period. You started with the Empress and you ended with justice, like, period. At the end of the day, like, you're going to get justice. Whoever this is that has been hating on you and been trying to cause you to have a tower moment. Yeah. Five of Swords, please. Yeah, the Four of Wands. It's because you don't want to reunite with this person anymore. It's because you're not married. This could be somebody here that you were married to or you were in some type of community with this person and... 
I feel like there's some type of inner conflict here amongst this group. Four of Wands, Five of Swords. Page of Swords, yeah, and they're watching you. What's the Page of Swords? Page of Wands. They're watching you get good news. Queen of Wands. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, heavy, yeah, Aries and Leo. What's the page of wands? There is some communication coming to this queen of wands. Or this queen of wands could be communicating with you or somebody wants to communicate. What's the queen of wands, page of wands? Okay. The hangman. And somebody was caught. Yeah, they're under judgment. Somebody was caught maliciously gossiping about an individual here. Yep. And we have the Empress and a Page of Cups. Somebody here could be having a surprise pregnancy. Mm -hmm. I feel like somebody's about to give birth. And they're like, what? Okay. <laughs> Judgment in reverse. Somebody here hasn't been following their calling on the path. Yeah, the Ten of Wands. Okay. Somebody feels like following their calling is like stressful. Okay, so either somebody could have been doing. It's like whoever this is that ignored the calling here, now they got a struggle, period. Because they ignored the calling. They got a struggle. I feel like that's justice for you. Give me more than this Five of Swords. Who is in this Five of Swords energy trying to win at all costs? The Death card. Scorpio. Yeah, or somebody here wanted to hurt somebody. They wanted to hurt you, Libra. Yeah, somebody didn't want to see you alive at all. Yeah, we got the Strength card. Yeah, they wanted to see you weak and insecure. And um, whoever this is, they don't have no loyalty to you at all. This could be a Leo, a Scorpio, an Aquarius. And now they embarrassed because you possibly exposed their ass. I feel like this energy is weak anyway. Are they very insecure or are they they're inadequate? Give me the strength in reverse with the five of swords of death. The justice in reverse. Yeah, they're not taking accountability. I feel like you're still getting what you want anyway, period. Yeah, like I said, you're still getting what you want. You're still moving forward here. Whoever this is, they got some karma up their ass. Yeah, I feel like you're just going to be resting, chilling. Yeah, because you know you're getting justice. The Empress. And it's justice right here. I feel like you're going to be resting. You're going to be chilling. You you know that you're, you're getting justice here. Okay. I don't know, Libra. I think I'm a little bit worn out today. I think I need to get me some rest. Give me some final messages for Libra. Whoever this is, they're never going to take accountability here. They're too insecure to take accountability. They're too weak to admit their wrongdoing. So I feel like you're just going to say, fuck it, and just move on in your chariot. Even if this person, if they don't ever want to take accountability, that's fine. But the, the karma that they have to pay back is something very large. It's on a grand scale. Um, this karma that they have to endure because they try to set you up to be unalive. Yeah. We have the five of wands. More jealousy. Because you make the right decisions. The two of wands, the six of pentacles. So I feel like somebody's mad, they're they're angry, they're jealous with you because you're going in the opposite direction or you're moving or you're moving forward with life, you're making decisions, you're leaving that, that five of wands petty shit behind that is beneath you. The will of fortune, you're going towards your destiny, period. Your north node. Five of wands. The King of Swords in reverse. The Page of Pentacles.
This person's not going to give up without a fight. They're going to tell you that they have a new idea or they're, they're going to try to come in with some type of small offer to get you to stay, Libra. This King of Swords is in reverse. This person is going to make up anything to get you to stay or to not go towards this will of fortune or not to not go towards your destiny. That's what they're going to do. This is all so you won't leave them. Five of Pentacles. Yeah, it's like somebody was watching you and they know that you're going to be a star. They know you're going to be a star, Libra. They don't want you to leave. But this energy lies too fucking much. King of Swords in reverse. There's always going to be some type of scheme, plot, plan going on. A setup to me. I just can't trust an energy like that. It's never going to be, uh-uh. It, they ain't going to never keep it a buck with you, man. Ever. It's always going to be a plot. Yeah, the three of wands. It's always going to be a plan. Let me see. What can, I, what can I do now? What's the three of wands? Somebody's always going to be thinking about what they can do in the future. Yeah, the queen of swords. I mean, the queen of cups and the king of cups. And then this energy is possibly going to always have you in a third party. Yeah, they're going to always be non-committal. They're going to always lie about a third party. They're going to always have you in a third party with somebody that's emotionally manipulative. They're always going to have this person in their ear. So really, can you fuck with this person? I don't think so, Libra. I feel like you're going to be getting victory on your own. This Ten of Earth is releasing here. With this Nine of Earth, that's on your own. Single energy. You getting that on your own. This energy is the type of person that's going to always have you in. in, And it's like they just have a lack mindset. Man. Yeah, dodging bullets. Yeah, blocking negativity. Scraping pe crazy people protected by haters. This person's going to always be a hater to you. Yeah. Screenshots, getting evidence, proof, facts. But that's in reverse. Somebody doesn't know too much about you. They think they got something on you. They ain't got shit. Yeah, this player that's in love with you. But they confused. You see what I'm saying? Don't A confused mind is a very dangerous mind. A confused mind is a dangerous mind. I can't fuck with a confused mind. If you can't make up your mind, like, I can't I can't fuck with you. You're going to throw off my whole equilibrium, my whole balance. You know what I mean? Nah. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. You're going to throw it all off, especially the person that ain't shit. You can't make up your mind and you ain't shit. It's just a bad investment. You can't invest in, in nothing like this. Whoever this energy is, they feel like they know everything. They know it all. You can't tell this energy nothing. They're very narcissistic. Cold-hearted, too. And they're very smart when it comes to their words. Yeah, this is the type of person that be watching you from fake accounts. Okay? Somebody's fine to see like where you're going. Yeah, if you're in a relationship with somebody. I feel like you're just moving on, Libra. There's a masculine here that's mad that's trying to use children to or there's a feminine. Somebody here's like mad trying to use children as a manipulation tactic because they know that you're moving on. Yeah. A secret lover. Libra, this reading is so ghetto, baby. I'm going to leave it there, though. Like, comment, subscribe, turn the notification bell on so you will not miss any of my videos. Until next time, Libra. Hopefully, you was able to find some messages in here. It's just giving, like, yeah, keep going on your journey, man. Um, I feel like this energy is, like, the type of energy that would never take accountability. Um, this person's judgment from not following their calling is to be struggling, Okay. This could be a long struggle here. A long... Mm -mm. This is a long burden that this person has to carry. 
that's because they refused to, they were stubborn in their ego too prideful to come and admit their wrongdoing so she i mean what can you do libra not a damn thing but keep going on with your life i'm gonna leave it there bye boo